things. Um, my house, and Alberti knows this, I'm like picture wall crazy. I, I just love my family. Um, and I love inspirational things and all of that. And when these came into my life just this week, I went crazy because we had just repainted a room and redone a basement. And I was about ready to go with nails and a hammer and enter these. No tools, no studs needed. As long as you have drywall, these push right in just like this. You can see they hold each of them up to 20 pounds. And I'm going to tell you my favorite thing about this is that when you take them out, all it leaves is these two little tiny, almost like, like little dots that actually drywall, you could just fill those in with toothpaste. Let's say you rent or you don't want to damage your walls. Each one of these holds 20 pounds. You can hang from here, you can hang from here, and all you do is push them in. That's how simple they are. I love this. You get 32 of them, and you have the 20 pound ones, so you get 24 of the 20 pound hooks, and then you get eight of the 40 pound hooks, the one that hold up to 40 pounds. Five easy payments of $6. Do we want to show our video first or should I bring in uh, Megan? Let's actually bring in Megan and she'll introduce this product to us. Megan Elizabeth is a home solutions expert, a mother of four. Uh, she introduced me to these last week and I was so excited. Megan, uh, these are fantastic. Oh, hi, Kirsten. I know I love these. And what's so great about these is that you're getting the bundle of not only 20 pound drywall hooks, but also the 40 pound hooks. So those large mirrors, those steel chalkboards that I love to hang, the family command centers in the kitchen, any wall that has drywall walls, no tools required, and you're hanging in just seconds time. All you're gonna do is come to your drywall walls, find where you wanna hang it, look, look, look. place it, and press she it pushed in, it in. Thumb or palm of your hand. That's it. There was no, no hammer. There was no nope. drill. There was no, you know, like you mess up, that's okay. Pull it, take it out and go somewhere else and then put a little toothpaste in the hole. Right, that's it, that's it, no tools. And you're not leaving huge, giant like anchor holes in your walls. You're not trying to puncture all the way through. These hooks actually don't even puncture through the back of your drywall. So you're really causing very minimal damage with those pin holes that are left behind. And really, I love filling them with toothpaste because I love to create walls at my house and then change things up for the seasons, for the holidays. I can add, hang up sports memorabilia or fun art or pictures of my family and my kids love to have. I love doing the chalkboards and changing things out and I can quickly and easily do it. No tools required, just place, press and hang and you're good to go and in any drywall wall. You know, I'm not an engineer, shocker. Uh -huh. um, <laughs> Very far from that, but I got to believe it's because of the distribution. Listen to me, though. I sound like one. The distribution of weight with the two little hooks there and then the way that it's like flat and against the wall. It's like using the drywall and it's using the surface area to hold that 20 pounds, even though all you do is push this into the wall. You do not need a hammer. Um, you should have seen me, Megan, after I was trying to redo the kids' bedroom and like do the painting and all the spackling I had to do from all the holes and the things pulling out. This is such a better solution. Absolutely, because you're hanging 20 or 40 pounds of weight. And for me, I've already had a mirror crash and burn in my house because I was trying to use things that weren't exactly weight rated for the weight of that mirror. Right. And that's no fun to have to clean that up. These I know are holding my decor, my mirrors, safe and secure in my walls and not leaving damage behind. And the other thing that's really cool, Kirsten, is that the 20 pound hooks have a little hook at the top that are great for your saw teeth hangers. And then that bottom hook is really great for your wire hangers. Yeah. So it really glides on there very easily. The only difference you'll see with the 40 pound is that it just has that one hook on the bottom. But again, you're holding so much more weight and all you're doing is coming up to your drywall walls, finding where you want to place it and pressing it in with the thumb or palm of your hand. And we're hanging anything that really speaks to our family and our lifestyle. And I just love that so Look much. Look at that. It holds so mm -hmm. much. Um, these are very popular. People are buying more yeah. than one. You're so smart. I did the same thing. I can't wait to show you when they get to my house. Um, how many left? <laughs> 3,500 are now left to go around. Give them a try. If you don't love them, you get a 30 day love it or return it guarantee. But at my house, we used to have like this little container of nails and hammers because mommy, that's me, um, would go around and I hang things all the time and pictures and sayings and like pictures of the beach and all that kind of stuff. And I, I mess up all the time because I'm not good at this stuff. 
And so there's holes in walls and things fall out and then the kids hang too much on the on the hook and then it pulls out of the wall. Like this is so much easier because because even if you need to move it or take it out and let's say you're moving or you're you're in a rental location or something like that, this is all that is left behind are little tiny, 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 tiny holes. And all you do is push for them to go in. And Megan told me, and I believe her because she's very smart and she has four kids, is that you can put toothpaste in here to fill this up. You don't even need a spackle. Yeah, you don't need a spackle. And that's what's so great about them is because you really can just press them in. And you can see, I'm just gonna press in a whole bunch. They go in this effortlessly right into your drywall walls. Now, if you do have a denser drywall, that uh, maybe has a fire coating or something different, you could use a little hammer or a little mallet to get it a little bit extra in, but really they're just going in all the way flush with the thumb or palm of your hand. And this is all the bigger those holes are, which is totally different than these little huge anchors that would leave huge holes in your wall that go all the way through your drywall that you have to fill with spackle, you have to fill yeah. with tools for, you don't need to do that with the high and mighty hooks. I love these. 2,800 left to go around. Remember, you get 32. I need. I don't think I said that enough, because that's really important to note. You get 32 mm -hmm. of these. I don't think you can buy nails yep. for that inexpensive. 32 right. of these, you get a, a pack and some mix of 24 of the 20 pound and eight of the 40 pound. Um, they are made out of metal and they only work on drywall. So that's important to note too. You can only put these on drywall, but majority of walls are going to be drywall. And 20 and 40 pounds is actually quite heavy. So you're seeing these big art pieces that these hold. Yeah, it's so cool that you can really do like the steel chalkboards and the family command center, the mirrors, the mirrors, the clocks, the sports memorabilia. Of course, your collections of, you know, the family sayings and the family portraits. I like to keep a pack in my kitchen junk drawer. I believe it or not, have a pack up in my uh, bathroom, in my upstairs bathroom. That way, if I ever want to hang or adjust anything really quick, all I'm doing is coming over to my wall and I'm pressing it in and I'm ready to hang the next picture or create create the next gallery wall or decor in my home. These are so smart. I love them. I can't wait to use them. I'm really excited. Over halfway <laughs> through our quantities. You should get them home too right away. 30 day love it or return it guarantee. Megan, keep them coming. What a great product. Thanks for sharing. Thanks, Kirsten. Have a great day. You too. Okay, Albert, he's always playing games. That jokester. Time for a big deal. All right, so listen, um, we have got the game of all games for everybody today. No quarters necessary, just lots of fun to be had when you bring home arcade.